Hey guys, what's up? Well, today we're going to test out the new plow mod. Um, this is uh, an up and down switch in place of this left and right garbage, which, well, it's not really garbage. I guess you can get used to anything. And uh, so anyways, another YouTuber um, that has the FR has been doing a lot of experimenting and upgrading. And so he came up with the idea for the up and down switch and um, it actually works okay now you won't get any access to your trim control and of course this is now disabled okay I have a video showing it so does he on how to do the mod okay um, so anyways um, anything to make life a little easier now if this doesn't work out uh, with the switch for me to my liking he, he did mention that you can use a 10k uh, volume potentiometer controller uh, in place of the switch and then just rotate the blade to the depths that you need it up and down which is another cool idea okay um, also if you find there's too much upward throw which I've already found out um, so when you park the machine actually throw the blade down and uh, then this way it takes all the pressure off but you can put a servo saver in there to relieve some pressure uh, or a shorter servo horn okay uh, so there's a lot of options here so anyways let's give this thing a test on the deck here we got some nice fresh snow and uh, we'll see how this thing actually does work so we got regular movement which is now a lot easier to drive so let's throw this thing down Traction sucks on the deck. Unless with the dual rates, we'll see what happens. Liking. Let's go down on the ground. Uh, so we'll just shut the video off for a second, come back up, and we'll go on the ground and see how this thing works. Okay, guys, we're down on the ground and we're going to try this out and see what happens. So, regular drive. jammy spots in there. So I think we add some weight in here, which I'm going to try. I'm also going to reduce the uh, pressure on the servo for the downforce, as well as the upforce a bit, so that it can come down just a bit. And uh, we'll give it another test. So this was test one, which uh, I think was reasonably successful. Um, so now it's time to visit the servo saver idea and uh, reduce uh, the top end height as well as the bottom pressure and see what happens. So thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next one, guys.